Hello, my name is Serge LeBlanc, I'm a technical support engineer with One Identity. This is my video on how to upgrade Active Role Server to version 7.2. In this video, we will be covering the following how to upgrade the Active Role Server Administration Service, how to upgrade the Active Role Server database, and how to upgrade the Active Role Server web interfaces. Okay, so here we have my lab environment that which at the moment has ARS 7.1 installed um, as you can see here's my domain connected and I've also put in a test policy so this way we can see how the test policy and everything transfers over once we upgrade to 7.2 so to start the upgrade simply open up the installation files and double click on active roles click on the little security warning read through the introduction click on next you can read through the license terms and you have to accept and then click on next now this is a warning if you have office 365 add-on installed it's not supported in 7.2 so it's going to have to be uninstalled first for more details on how to do this you can read the release notes for 7.2 and then click on next then read the little summary and then simply click on upgrade now this warning will come up that some files are in use and it will require a reboot. So that's an important thing to keep in mind that the upgrade will actually require a reboot. So simply click on continue. Now that the installation is complete, we simply click on finish and then we will do a restart now. Okay, so now that the reboot has completed, the first thing you want to do is open up the ARS 7.2 configuration center. and then the upgrade configuration will come up so here you simply read through this little introduction and then you have to confirm that you've read the configuration active rule 7.2 for in place upgrade section in the quick start guide agree that you've read it and then hit next and then it starts the upgrade process of the database and the administration service as you can see here, it is now importing the information from your from your 7.1 database. And it will also upgrade your websites during this process. Once it is complete, you'll have this completion screen and then just simply click finish and the upgrade should be complete. You just have to wait for the service to get ready. Once this turns green and is ready for use, you can simply open up the ARS 7.2 MMC console. And as you can see, everything is as it was. Our domain is still connected and if we go under the policies our test policy is still present so everything all the configuration information gets transferred over and that completes the upgrade of ARS to learn more about active role server please feel free to visit support.oneidentity.com